it's time to do that string thing that we do. It's 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 time for more Count Lucanor. It's gonna be great. I'm excited. I'm stoked. Sorry we started a little late. I had shit going on. And things I had to do. I'm sorry I have a life. <laughs> Let me just come in here with like all this all this pointed pointed feelings, apparently. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Words are just coming out and it's fine. It's Wednesday, my dudes. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Um, yeah, we're halfway through the week. It's we're going. We're trudging through it. We're making it work. It's happening, I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> well, it's happening regardless of whether we want it to or not. Um, yeah, we're gonna do more Count Lucanor today. I'm excited. Uh, I really enjoyed this when we started it on Monday, and I think we got decently far. Uh, let's go ahead and tell Hades to chill out for a second while I swap things around. Is that better? Hey game, don't don't clip with your audio. That's not a great sound. Hey, don't do that. Why are you doing that, huh? Can I wiggle some of these wires? Make it less clippy? No. I don't know if you can hear it or not, so I guess it doesn't Hopefully it's not too bad. Um, hopefully sound isn't too loud either. Doesn't look awful, but that doesn't mean anything. Anyway, we're gonna continue on from where we left off. Which I think we had... We had just saved so that we could... Get the bucket? We did the bucket. We put out the fire in the fire room. Thank goodness. And we were gonna try to get... We are gonna try to get the letter that's in the library. Also, let's put this paper that we got on this. One, two, three, four. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna have to write all these down. <laughs> um, yeah, we definitely have to get the one that's in the library because it's in the library. Not because it's in the library, but because we need it. We need eight, all eight letters, even though the thing only calls for seven, I think? No, it calls for eight. Lucanor is seven. Oh my god, I'm already really bad at the puzzle. It's cool. How many rooms do we have? Two on each side. And... Okay, so... How do we draw this? I guess we'll just do it this way, right? Hi, welcome to my, to my bad mapping three is there I've made this too small hi I've done it very bad that should work I guess <laughs> do you like do you like my notes? Oh no, it's too bright. Hold on. Ah! They're very good. I don't write down which game the note is for. I just put down the notes and I'm like, yeah, I guess that works. <laughs> We've done it very bad. Okay, so that's seven. That's also seven. One. Okay, so I guess if we have one one of the ones from seven, then we don't need the other one because they're the same. I do vaguely remember us coming across two eyes. Uh, that is six? No, that's four. Three, five, and eight. Okay, now to wander around these hallways figure out the corresponding letters. Because obviously that's a map of the halls, right? Right. Oh, 
I forgot the bad ghosties were here. Um, hope the audio's okay. <laughs> Where is... Is that the fifth one? Right, and we don't have that one yet. I need the ghosty to go away. I would just like immediately try and figure out the library puzzle, but let's write down all these letters first before I forget, because I will, and then we'll need it later, and it and it'll be bad. Because what is planning ahead? All right, we'll figure out three and four in a minute. There's a there's a servant dude. Is that what they were called? Servants, terrible ghosty servants. Is this R? I just want to know what that door is! That's N. What is this one? A? Um... I, so then that one is also going to be I. Unless it's not, in which case that would be very, very rude, and I would hate that. P. Also I. Also I. Okay, so I just need to figure out what's, what's behind door number three. <laughs> and... Eight. The last one is whatever the one is. Whichever one is in the library. I need him to go away. T. Also, there's someone in there? Also, there's a... He's hiding in the closet! <laughs> hide in there, bud. What am I supposed to do here? I do have this mirror that I haven't used. We've used the ring in the box puzzle. I'm s okay, so we're supposed to uh supposed to distract our buddy here. The red carmelingo? Carmen. We're supposed to distract Carmen here. With something. With the clock, assumably, right? Oh, can I use the can I use the crowbar to open? Move, move. I need you to go. Oh god. Fuck, it's dark. Okay, now it's not dark. Oh, I hate it. Here, let's put a candle here as well. So that I can see everywhere that I'm trying to go. going. Go through. Go through, buddy. But yeah, am I supposed to use the, cr uh, the pry bar to... What do I do? like he's distracted with that right so <laughs> what else do you want from me buddy I've taken everything yeah I know you have that book just turned its pages on its own
like Go through. Why won't you go through? There's ghosty guys down here. Can I look at this? It's a family book. It seems the Count Luganor had many wives, but only a child. Had only one child, you mean? Lucrezia. Seen your remarkable books. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't come up here. <laughs> Sir, I am trying to read. It's a book named The Four Kings. It reads, A long time ago, there were four kings. They were bound by the bonds of friendship. Whenever they met, they always laughed, for they enjoyed each other's company. So they decided to fight the war together. Uh, when they returned with the spoils, one of them betrayed the rest. Even if he wore a smile, he had always been greedy and mean. The famous painting of the king's story decorates one of the walls of the, of the Tenebrae Castle. Okay, well. Sir, 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 sir. Stop! <laughs> Don't see any remarkable books. It's a book named Magic Jewels. A skeleton is not my buddy. Um, Skeleton, I think he's trying to be my buddy, but I really don't want to be his buddy. You know how it is. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he does have some common decency and doesn't want to, doesn't want to get me while I'm reading. Which is nice of him, but that's not enough to, you know, let me be his friend. Um... On. There's a book named Magic Jewels. It reads, one of the most coveted jewels by merchants was a snake ring. This unique piece showed the bearer whether an object was fake by shedding red light. There's an interesting book here. It reads, the red carmelango uh, commands the servants of the great Tenebrae castle. Stern and devoted to his duties, he will not hesitate to punish with instant death even negligible errors. Yeah, I mean, we know this about him. That doesn't tell me how I'm supposed to beat him, though. Okay, now you guys decide to patrol. Now you decide to patrol around here. Hold on, there's a room we haven't checked. This is the only one that I need to get a letter from. I've got the rest of the puzzle sorted. Well, not sorted. Whatever Kobold's name is, it starts with a P. Do we have... Won't open. Oh, right. Are the things facing them... Uh, are the, the clock faces? Are they facing each other now? No. I think I missed my chance to make that happen. Yes, exactly. Pumple Stiltskin? 100% his name. Despite it being more than eight letters, it's a hundred percent his name. Um, fuck. There was one room I didn't check. <gasps> Zero! Hi! How's it going? I don't think I checked this room because there was a guy in here. And I was spooked. Also, I have... There's a missive. One of the soldiers has told me Miss Lucrezia has ta been taken to the depths of the castle. Oh, wait, no, we read that one. Is this not the room, then? No, pick that up. Pick that up! Clean up your room, sir. How's it hanging, Cyril? What are you? It's almost like she's staring right at me. That's scary. Um... It's really- I like it so far. Um, would recommend. It's spooky. Stop. Stop. Stop with this. Stop with this nonsense. It's an old missive. He's been around witches and sorcerers lately. I don't know what he's planning, but I pity the poor sitting in the throne and inheriting who knows what burden on their shoulders. The puzzles are really great. Um, stop. Stop it. Stop it! Stop! 
No, you can't see me. I'm not in here. Oh. Can you go away? For just a minute. For just a minute. I got two portions of cheese. Anything else? Nothing else in here. This room was useless. Yeah, this this room was stupid and dumb and awful, and now I hurt. Everything is hurt. Good thing we got that cheese. Nope, it quit it, you absolute goon. Eat it. Eat the cheese. Stop. 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 It's fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> um... Yeah, a good game would recommend. You should play it. <laughs> Especially if you got it. Oof. Um. I don't know what to do in the library. I don't know how to get Carmen to fuck off. Can I give the mirror the mirror? Hey, mirror buddy. Hey, friend. Told me he couldn't help me anymore. I better leave him be. Or you could not. Constantly pester him. It's empty. I've already looted this room. Count is really sick. Once he's passed away, he may lower or we may lower the bar of the trials. Finding a new heir shouldn't take that long. Yeah, I've taken everything. Can I look at you? No. Like, okay. So we're supposed to distract Carmen, right? I, I thought that the clock would do it. But apparently not. So what... Can I... Yeah, our good, good goat buddies. They're bored in the garden and want to have a party, huh? What? What's going on? Nothing. I've just read something interesting, but it's not related to the kobold. <gasps> tell me, tell me! It seems there's a book the Let Count's daughter carry, carried everywhere. No! Oh <laughs> Do the goats have a knife? Lucrezia? Yes, it might hide some precious clues on the treasure. And where's the book? It should be in the library, but those servants are roaming everywhere. Leave it to me, I can find it. Can you? Oh, oh, can you? Thanks a lot, Hans. I thought she was doubting him for a second, because I would as well. <laughs> Look, the book is called From Caterpillar to Butterfly. It has a red cover. All right, I'll try to find it. Don't take unnecessary risks to retrieve it. Remember, it's not related to the kobold's name. But isn't it? I wish I had a knife. <laughs> In game, that is. Okay, so we need... Maybe that's why I can't get this last letter. Unless this is it. No! From caterpillar to butterfly. Oh, I don't see it here. Magic jewels. Gift knife! Gift knife! Okay, it's not there. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of lot of dudes in here now. Oops, all servants. This isn't from caterpillar to butterfly. Don't put that there. Uh oh, hold on. Tower of Tribute, home to the private count chambers, is definitely worth visiting. Old sources mention a big underground dungeon where the enemies captured in the castle were thrown. This isn't from caterpillar to butterfly. Stop! <laughs> oh, Carmen's gonna know I'm here. And I keep equipping the food instead of eating it. No! It's a family book. It seems the Count Lucanor had many wives. This isn't it. Hey, excuse me, I'm gonna just sneak in here. There you are! 
Fucking caterpillar to butterfly. I'm keeping this. Okay, I better hurry. Let's go. I like that you can kind of bug the game out. Like, they can't pull you, pull you in if you were looking at something previously. Like, the effect just ceases to work. And that's great. I love that for me. If this mad whispering could go away, though, that would be cool. Hey, Julia? I should show her the book. Oh, well. Here's the book. There you go. Giving Julia the book. Good job, Hans. I see your uh, I see your treasure hunter material. It's true. <laughs> Knowledge is power. And all that nonsense. <laughs> Thanks. Let's see. It seems an old butterfly catalog. It has some drawings. Wait, what's this? There's a piece of paper in here. It has the number eight written three times. Could be some code. Look, I think it's best you keep it. I'll keep examining th this for more clues. Got a code. I don't know what this reference is, Fruity. It's, it's a combination. Thanks. Don't face me. Don't do that. <laughs> Explain. Is it No Hands Cat? Oh, no. It's No Hands. Okay, I understand. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Nothing will ever beat Hands Cat. Cat with hands. Yeah, use the code. Give me the thing. Butterfly net. I should show this to Julia. <laughs> Can you find it? I'm sure it exists on YouTube. <laughs> the only commercial that I like distinctly remember, um, not necessarily from as an a uh, YouTube advert, but like. I don't even remember if it was a joke or not, but the Chuck Testa thing? <gasps> Tell Peach to stop being a butthole. <laughs> but yeah, find this ad and then send it to me so I know what's happening. Oh, I should show her the butterfly net. Or you could just give it to her. Hey, look what I found, Julia. You show the butterfly net. Oh, Fruity sent it. What's this? Seems a 3-8 code opened a chest in the gardens. This was inside. Interesting. I bet Lucrezia caught butterflies with it when she was young. I'm amazed. You really solved this mystery, Hans. You're going to replace me as a treasure hunter soon. <laughs> hey, memes can be mainstream, too. Oh, thanks a lot. So what do I do with the butterfly net? You may keep it. You deserve it. But... What if this is a clue to get the treasure? You should keep it. It'll surely be an important clue, but I think I don't want to know anything else on this matter. How come? I'm scared shitless, Hans. I have to confess, I'm no professional treasure hunter. I actually like research more. I've never found a treasure, and you're not supposed to qualify until you find one. Oh, to be honest, I'm scared shitless too. I tell you one thing. Since we've helped each other, if I get the treasure and we meet again, I'll give you half the treasure. <gasps> Devo update for zero! My stupid little void boy likes to just cry all the time now. I mean, like, proper cry? Not just his chatty little nonsense that he was doing before, and it's miserable. Because he will be snuggling with me in the middle of the night, and all of a sudden just go, Ball! Ball! And it's like, bud... I'm right here. <laughs> All of the crying. Um, I thought, as of, like, Monday, I thought that he was crying because it's summertime and there's bugs. And, like, I live in a farmhouse, so there's gonna be bugs. And so he'll see a bug and cry about it instead of doing anything about it. But I don't know that that's the case now because he's doing it in the middle of the night while he's snuggling me. Maybe I just have, like, a spider on my ceiling or something that he's noticed and won't get. He'll just cry about it. But other than that, 
He's doing good. He will sleep with me all night, which is amazing. It's you. <laughs> oh, it's like, it's that, it's that crying that like, like he's distressed, but I think he's distressed that he can't get to it. Despite the fact that he could 100% get to the bug. <laughs> he is just useless, which makes the like two weeks that he was missing all the more miraculous. Cause it's like, how the hell did you survive out there, little boy? Little baby, how did you survive? Is he here? Yeah, he is. Come here, Devo. You heard me talking about you. Come here. No, don't walk away from me. No. Look. Look who it is. It's a Devo. No, you're stuck here now. This is where you live. He did look for two seconds. <gasps> there we go. Devo, hold on a second. Hold on a second, bud. Look. Look, I need you to acknowledge our friends, okay? <laughs> yeah. yeah? You look you look so disgruntled and yet you're purring so loud. Are you my sweet boy? Are you gonna give me a lick? <gasps> No chomps! <laughs> you're a good boy. We love you. Now your fur is all messed up, but I'm not gonna fix it. <laughs> so yeah, Devo's doing good. He's just a big old crybaby all the time. That's my that's my kid. I did get munched. <laughs> it was a very light nibble though. The kind that you the kind that you do when you're trying to groom someone. Unlike Lamia's chomps, which breaks skin because she doesn't know how hard she's biting. Oh, Lamia. <laughs> but that's a boy. He good. He good. Yeah, Llama. She is currently asleep under the desk because that's where she lives. <laughs> um... What is this? Well, I need to find it first. Oh, right, the treasure. I bet you will, Hans. I'll keep examining the books and try to find a way out of the castle. You follow your path. If we're lucky, we'll meet again outside. Do you have any... Okay, yeah, you're just wishing me luck. Alright, well, I got a net. <laughs> Can I... Can I use that on the car on Carmen? Hey, Carmen! I would like to catch you. <laughs> you can't do a nip and expect friends to continue to pet you. Also, yay! Peach! I love peaches. I love Willow. I love your animals. Also, Fruity, I don't remember your dog's name, but I love your dog. <laughs> oh. Mr. Right, right, right. Good dog. Good dog. That's good, good dog. Fruity, we demand a dog update. I need, I need Carmen to go away. Hey, buddy. I should go save before I try to do something stupid, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> We've just accomplished a lot, and I need to not die and redo all of that. How is Doggo faring in the heat? I know you're not doing too well in the heat, but how is the Doggo? I need to know that Lister is okay. I'm trying to get him to walk up some dog stairs to reach the window seat, and today he went all the way up for the first time! <gasps> Good dog, good dog. Oh, oh, no one's happy about the heat. As long as he's okay. That's precious. You've been working on getting him to go up those stairs for a while now, right? Like at least a week. I remember the I remember there being mention of the the dog stairs. Oh, wow. All right, game saved. <laughs> 
Stairs are scary. They're spooky. I had considered getting stairs for Lamia. Um, because sometimes she jumps real bad. <laughs> and it's terrible, but it's very funny when she does it bad. Obviously, I check to make sure she's okay before I start laughing, but... <laughs> stairs are scary she does though so like i mean she's never been particularly graceful because she's just a stumpy little bean but especially after her stroke uh like it just it was a hundred times worse she just did it so bad <laughs> and so like for a time oh our <laughs> Are he and Lamia, like, spirit animals? Are they the same? <laughs> they are the same being. <laughs> oh, goodness. Can I get him with this? Fuck! I love it, especially when with cats that are usually very good about jumping. I love it when they just biff it. Because it's like, you've done this so bad, animal. Have you considered not being bad at this? Go check the clock out. It's locked. Oh god, he's gonna see me. I don't know how to distract him. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do that. And then go under here. And then get him? Nope, we're dead. We're absolutely dead. That's fine, we just saved. I don't know what to do. Because we don't have a key, so I can't unlock it. And I've tried... I've tried using the pry bar, and that doesn't work. Fruity, do you want to be on hint duty for me? Ooh, hiccups. What was I saying about Lamia, though? Doing stairs bad. No, doing jumps bad. Ah, what a champ. Um, it's the library room. Distracting the, the Carmelango. Uh, if that helps narrow down what you're looking up. It's true. It really is true. Fruity is super pog. We love Fruity. Um, but yeah, Lamia, like, has never been great at jumping. But especially, like, after her stroke, she did it even worse than before nowadays she's like she's she's gotten back to being able to use her whole body which is great all that <laughs> all that at home physical therapy has paid off <laughs> um but occasionally she just doesn't jump quite high enough especially for my bed my bed's like pretty high up off the floor usually she can get it but occasionally she can't and so she'll like jump and just not even get to the edge of the bed so you'll just hear her like smack the side um really okay well i guess we'll do that that seems weird um yeah no she is <laughs> But it's great, too, because, like, I mean, my bed's high up off the floor, but it's not so high that if she fucks up a jump, she's gonna, like, hurt herself. Um, but yeah, you'll just hear, like, the whiff of the <laughs> the blankets that hang off the edge just kind of, you know, <laughs> flap around a little bit. And then you can just hear her go, <sighs> as she, like, huffs and then stomps away, because, you know, the bed did her dirty. <laughs> um also very fun because the cat box like i mean it's just it's just a tub it's basically just a tub with like a hole cut out in the top like in the lid um because the the lip on the lid helps her get into the cat box so she doesn't just face plant into it but again occasionally she 
um, over overestimates her jump and will just like flip into. The well, now he's done it. I see. Well, let's. Oh, he closed it. Yeah, the whispering's not great. We don't like it. It's locked. Here. Let's just turn that down a smidge for y'all while we just hang out here. Open it. Okay, maybe I just won't use the clock at all. Maybe I'll just go grab it while he, after he opens it. He's got the fanciest hat and the biggest sleeves. Have I done this bad? Because I, oh god, oh no. Sir! Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. Um, also, I should start writing out this name. <laughs> The big wombo hat. I would wear a fancy hat like that. Just saying. He is he is mean. He doesn't like me. He's just doing his job though. I guess I can't be too mad. But also, fuck you and your giant hat. Give give hat. <laughs> oh, oh, we got Pat. Is his name Patrick? Nah. Please don't let this boy's name be Patrick. Four? No, it's not. Five. Where is six? Okay, we just need this last one. Um, But so far I have for our little kobold's name is Patroni. Oops, all vowels. No. So we... Let me go in here. I know I could just save. So I'm going to turn this off for a second so you can see my beautiful little little notes. So there are all there are all the letters in their corresponding rooms and the na or the, the order that they're supposed to go into. <laughs> and that, that is the name that we've got so far, but we're missing the last letter. You like my beautiful notes? Aren't they very good? Yeah, oops, all vowels. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Cyril. It's fine. <laughs> I want his name to be Patronic. Because it's kind of like Patrick. <laughs> but I guess we'll find out once we get this letter. You know how it goes. Okay. Yeah, let's let's watch you open this thing. <laughs> Stop looking at the book. Why? It's great. It's locked. How am I supposed- am I supposed to do it? Oh my god. Right? He's just like, no, no one will ever get in here. <laughs> Keeping your shit safe? Unacceptable! I need to add that as a voice command, by the way. Or a uh, sound. Do I do it? Okay, so the clock is involved. Do I do it when he opens it then? That sounds, that sounds like the thing. Like, as soon as it's open, I gotta do the clock. I'm panicking. Clock! No! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> did you like my terrible laugh? My awful laugh? 
Got the letter O. Patronio? His name is Patronio? His face is spooky. His face is spooky. Um, also, if you like this game, you should check out uh, Baroque Decay's other game called Yuppie Psycho. It's very good. <laughs> it's about how scary working in an office is. Oh, and I guess kind of being a witch hunter, too. Is this really... This doesn't feel right. Patroni! Something books. Wish you luck in your adventure. Okay, well... Let's go save. I got 11 coins. I got some saves to spare. <laughs> Patroni! Let's go say hi to Mr. Patroni. Um. But yeah, I just want everyone to play Yuppie Psycho because it's a good game and I really, really like it. <laughs> Alright, let's go do the thing, I guess. As you may see, you have collected enough letters to display my name. You will notice the device in the middle of the hall. I wasn't there before. What is it for? You just need to place the letters as you may see fit and press the button to know whether you have guessed right. I understand. This seems easy. A final warning, sire. Whenever you make a combination and press the button, you will lose some health for every missing or misplaced letter. What? Take your time to think the combinations you want to try, as you could pass away should you have multiple errors, sire. Hi, Devo. Don't scream at me. No, we no scream. We don't scream in this house. <laughs> That's a lie. We do. We definitely scream in this house. Alright. Patroni! <laughs> I would say he says hello, but y'all probably heard him. Devo. Oh my god. Oh! 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 I'm only encouraging this, and I need to not. Okay. <laughs> He's so chatty all of the time. It's cute for the first five minutes, and then you're like, bud, no thank you. It's legit like having a toddler. I mean, we all joke about cats being toddlers anyway. Um, is this right? P-A-T. What's number four? Yeah, R. I just want to make sure I wrote this down properly. Um, but it's like legit the definition of like a kid being like, look at me. Look, look. Mom, look, look. Mom, look. Mom, look, look. Hey, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> so chatty all of the time i do i do love it when kitty cats do the little beeps though like tell me all about it bud <laughs> do the beeps we like the beeps uh okay oh and i Oh. Patronio. That's you got a dumb name, bud. <laughs> yeah, just oh my god. Cats. They're ridiculous. <laughs> I gotta get that other O all the way over here and I'm not happy about it. <laughs> All right. Look here, bud. No! Can I not get behind it? Okay, I can. He's really just, like, making me work for this. And I don't like it. <laughs> I'm ten years old. I'm not strong. And you're making me push these big old letter blocks around. Like, come on, my dude friend pal have you considered not did we spell that right i don't know 
Congratulations, sire, for your feat. The name is indeed Patronio. Really have a strange name. It's been really difficult. Indeed, this is no easy task, but you have proved to have the wit, skill, and bravery to succeed at such an arduous assignment. This door leads straight to the private chambers of the Count. You may now walk through the door if you wish, sire. Thanks! Bye, Petronio. Um, we're gonna go save, because again, I've got like ten coins on me. And I don't want to have to push those blocks around anymore. <laughs> Ever again. And we can go chat at everyone before we leave. You know how it is. All right, Grandma. Oh, there. She's just saying the same thing. I've learned. I made that mistake uh, twice on on Monday, with both games we played. <laughs> Only 51 minutes? Oh, dang. Yeah, they're all saying the same stuff, and that's unfortunate. Um, but yeah, I made that mistake on Monday while playing this game. Because uh, I went into the library after doing the whole fire puzzle thing. And doing all this stuff. I'm sure Pig Boy is fine. Last I knew, he was eating corn off the floor. We can go say hi. It has been a minute. Um, right? He's, he really do be living that dream. Is it this room? No, this is fire room. We love us some floor corn. No! No! No, don't be stuck there. Oh, he's stuck there. Okay. No! This ghost is making it very difficult. The floor cords a good meal <laughs> three minutes. I'd believe it. I think he'll stay here to finish the corn. Yeah, he's he's happy being naked eating corn. Like you do. Really do be living that dream. No! No! I need you to stop! Oh my god. Don't worry about it. It's just Pig Boy eating floor corn. <laughs> I love, I mean, in general, I like popping into into the middle of games with zero context and then just being like, what is happening? But, like, I feel like a lot of the games that I play, <laughs> people definitely, like, show up in the middle of it and just look at what's happening and are like, what the fuck, Keisha? Like, what are you doing? And it's like, living my best life, y'all. <laughs> I'm just here talking about naked pig men eating corn off the floor. Sire, the Count Lucanor waits beyond the door and he is eager to meet you. Ouch. Please mind your feet, Sire. This looks really bad. I better turn around. No, I will not. Oh! Well, that's extremely loud. That is so loud. Cute Halloween costume, big boy eating corn off the floor. Carmelango has told me you are not who you say you are. You are but a ragged child with no uh, peerage, nor money, nor a father. Did you expect that someone your kind could meet the most illustrious count? Yes. Yes, I did. It is an easy cosplay. You're not wrong. Hardest thing to get would just be floor corn, but, you know... I can find some tutorials. Okay. We'll do it like this. Mom? This is all a nightmare. This is all a bad, terrible nightmare. It's all a bad, terrible nightmare. Mom, you got a bug on your face. Mom! 
Oh, mom's dead. Well. Oh, dang! Ouch, that hurts. What a hit. Worms! What's all this blood? It's blood. Oh. Worms hurt me. Okay. Alright. Good to know. <laughs> Worms cause pain. What are you? <laughs> Worms are <under> my... <gasps> Why did it go out? Oh, please. Is there anyone there? Is that my dad? Is there anyone else down here? I'd say the voice came from there. From there? From where? This is 100% going to hurt me. <laughs> it's a golden emblem. It has an engraved L inside. <laughs> Hurdy worms are the worst worms, let's be real. Are you my father? Don't take the L. You have no feet, sir. Finally, someone's found me. Zowie, you're bleeding, like, a lot. Well, war was worse and I made it. Don't you worry, I'm fine. Tis only a flesh wound. What's your name, boy? I'm Hans. Nice to meet you, Hans. I'm... Oh, excuse me been down here for that long i can only remember my initials you can call me jf no problem but what are you doing here do you remember that yes i'm taking part in the count's trials oh me too well i was actually my goal is not fame nor wealth i'm doing this for love i'd like to marry count lucanor's daughter lucrezia that's a bummer i think we both have failed i don't see a way to escape this dungeon he has a lot of blood he has so much to spare, which is why he's like, it's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> On the contrary, mate. We're really close to escaping. This is the very last count's, the very last of the count's trials. Is it? I'm sure. We're just a step away from victory. If we help each other, we'll make it. But how? Not enough blood, if you ask me, honestly. <laughs> um... Uh, there's only one missing to open the door behind, so I just need to find the missing emblem, don't I? It's a thing, though. There are fake emblems in this dungeon. Mm. And how can I tell them apart? The only way is by placing them in the gap. If the mechanism is activated, then you've found the right one. Alright then, I'll try to find the missing golden emblem. Wait, my friend. Have this so you can save your soul. Thanks. Mind the creatures down here. They've got poor eyesight, but they'll hurt you badly if they manage to get you. Alright, well. Got two portions of bread. Yeah, no, I understand that I need to leave gold and I'll save my soul. Let's go ahead and save. Okay, thanks, buddy. Saved. Oh, okay. I saw the flash of red and was like, what is happening? And it's because I was looking at my my ring. Alright, I understand. Also, I would like to be able to see. So we'll just place some candles here and there. I don't have too many more, though, which is unfortunate. I don't, so I am covering it up, um, but I currently have seven candles. <laughs> but I'm going to place a few around, because, like, I would like to be able to know where things are. <laughs> a hole. Who's groaning? And can you not?
What the fuck are these noises? Hey, cat. Hi. Got two apples. As a thick boy! Devo is concerned. Okay, I don't know why I'm doing any of this anyway, because that's a fake emblem anyway. Unless there's more up here. <laughs> oh, the cat! Okay, the cat sound. I was like, I mean, I'm not here to judge. Oh no. no. No, 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 Yeah, I don't know why I did this puzzle. That's a fake emblem. <laughs> hey, I'm not here to yuck on your yum. You think those are cute sounds? <laughs> it doesn't work. I'm sorry. There it goes. There it goes. Why is my house here? Oh, didn't you know you just you've lived here all your life? Mom, open up. Mom. That's odd. Why are you locked? No, you roll. I love your cats. <laughs> Why are they all so good? It's like our well back at home, but this here stinks. Get away from me, worms. Got a coin. Cat party. I mean, cats are just very good. Let's be real. They're all they're all very good. Oh my god, stop. Got more candles. Like, I can make these noises too, guys. Terrible, awful creatures. This is a real one! Who's bitten me? Food! Nom! Let go! How did you get in my pants? I want food! I'm not getting any food, you darned creature. The food I got is meant for me. No! No what? Give me food! Nom! Alright, I think I'm wasting my time talking to him. I'll keep him in the backpack. Later I might find some use for this. Whatever this is. You've got a worm! You've got worm. You know, like you've got mail, but it's worms. I did that bad. I need to heal desperately. Don't equip. Don't equip the bread. Eat the bread. Do you like my worm? Look at him. Look at him. Freaking worms. <laughs> I don't want to go that way, but I do. I would like to stop getting hurt. First and foremost. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> he just wants some food. Just give the worm some food. I've died. I've died. I've done it bad. I've died. Um. God, I have to go collect all the things again. That's fine. I guess. We're not. It's not a lot of progress that we have to do, fortunately still more than I would like to do. I don't- I don't know! Should we find out? Listen to them.
they're bad. <laughs> they don't like their sounds. Only I can make bad sounds and have it be okay. No one else is allowed to make bad noises. <laughs> okay. 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 Voice mod. Rudy, you're gonna regret it. And you know you're gonna regret it. Hey, voice mod. Hey, voice mod. Oh, hang on a second. You've done the mistake again. Do you want, do you want a random one? Or do you want a specific one? What do we want? Oh, it opened up on the right, the proper side. <laughs> Cyril always wants the baby voice. <laughs> no baby voice. Shame. What do you want? <laughs> Gotta tell me. Random one? Do you wanna do you wanna roll the dice? See what we get? Random please. Can do, can do. Alright, hold on a second. I gotta swap microphones. Apparently. Roll them babies. You're gonna hate it. You're gonna hate it.
good again? Are we good again? <laughs> uh, yeah, I can only imagine how miserable the sneeze was. Because they're already bad enough in person. I bet it was nigh imperceptible. You couldn't hear it. It was so, so loud. This looks like the place for a lever, but the stick is missing! This is the one that I want, though, right? This is the real one? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's good to be back! Yeah, only your dog could hear it. It's, uh, my sneeze is a dog whistle. I think we all know this. Uh, we've learned this by now. God, where? This is bad. <laughs> I don't want to do any of this. <laughs> All right, we can agree. Only baby case from here on out. It's the only voice now. Ouch! Lever won't move anymore. Where? Where? Bitch, where? <laughs> Good clip! Travis! Hi! <laughs> I am surprised. How's it going, friend? Glad you were here for the sneeze. No, I did it again. I equipped it when I wanted to eat it. Them cheeks! Stop, stop, I'm not here. Why is your tracking so bad? And by so bad, I mean so good. We're just gonna sneak past the boy. I've done this bad. No! like a skin <laughs> No! <laughs> Why would you say that? Oh, I hate it too. With that, we're going to take a short break. Because I got to go to the bathroom and I just need to not think about skin burgers for a minute. Please? Please. No skin burgers. <laughs> it's a skin burger. Why would you make Kimmerald say such a terrible, nasty thing? <laughs> Thank you for the biddies, though. Um, it's laundry day and the mother-in-law is coming over tonight, so you have to pretend to be clean. <sighs> no, Travis! <laughs> I hate it! I'm leaving!
what you're all talking about. Too early. Nah. I also love this whole, this conversation that has occurred. Like, <laughs> and I appreciate the, uh, the build on of the lore for Six Foot Smell Distance. Um, cause I'm invested in this, in this band and I am glad to know that Travis is a part of it playing the maracas nonetheless. <laughs> no, there was just the just the one chip chimp chimp funk chip monk. <laughs> what? <laughs> um oh good lord, and now that's too loud. That game is too loud. Okay. Um well chimp funk so many chimp funks. Oh lord. Nope, I... <laughs> I hoped that maybe taking a bathroom break I would uh, forget. I would forget about Skin Burger, but it's still there. It's just hanging out in my brain. Living rent free. I don't want to call them that! <laughs> I don't want to call them Skin Burger. Cyril, it's bad. You've done it bad? I thought I was the one who had to make everything miserable for folks, but no, Cyril's gone and done it. I like butt burger more than skin burger. <laughs> I'll take a butt burger over skin burger, but it's all bad. Just the idea of them being burgers. They look like brains, okay? They look like gross, awful brains. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, y'all asked me for it. From my understanding, the Nina memes were, were specifically asked for, so I delivered, and I didn't even give you the majority of the ones that I had. <laughs> the chimp funks are in all simian jazz quintets I'd listen to them I don't even like jazz and I'd listen to them gotta support our our simian artists they're just out here doing their best um Maybe still hide my name's for Griffin back where I woke in the monster factory and I can't find it shame that's a good one. I think I've seen it and I may not have managed to save it. I do have, I just, I think I've mentioned it before. I do have a whole folder on my phone dedicated to specifically Nina memes because I'm that human. I'm that person that has to constantly remind everyone about the terrible thing that happened to that sweet, precious child and adorable, loving dog. <laughs> to be fair, I am a big fan of can't afford child care and a dog sitter. <laughs> but, you know. Modern problems require modern solutions. <laughs> Or the skin. Okay, no, I take it back. My favorite is the scale of uh, dogs from smallest to. Um, <laughs> from smallest to uh, Nina. To Nina Alexander hybrid. <laughs> yeah, I mean, am I wrong? <laughs> okay, we've got the worm again. <laughs> Let's finish getting the last of these boxes, which I think we I think we've collected all of them. Don't cry. No cries. Um to right, welcome back, Worm. We missed ya. Happy to have you back in our inventory. I'm pretty sure I dump it into the well. The well, actually. Man's favorite place to hang out. Um, 
but let's save so I don't have to do any of that ever again. <laughs> Thanks, Raven. Because <laughs> the awful fireplace, lo and behold, is where the real, the real emblem is. And I need it. Go away, burger. This is no place for butt burgers. Is this where the house is? No, this is the fire room. This is the room with the fire, which I guess let's do it. Right? So save. Yay. <laughs> Love that for us. Oh. Um. <laughs> so we uh, we found all of the letters earlier. Um, we finished most of the letters on Monday. But we found the remaining ones today. Um, Rumpelstiltskin, Rumpelstiltskin's name was not Rumpelstiltskin, but was in fact Petronio. Petronio, Petronio, where art thou, my Petronio? Um, it was dumb. It was awful. We found it. We solved all the problems. Pig boy was eating some corn. You know, like you do. <laughs> in a in a room with a cage, like you do. Uh, Carmen was being obnoxious and terrible. Uh, but yeah, we solved the name problem. Solved the name puzzle. And then fell fell down here because apparently they found out we were a no good kid and they were like mm -mm -mm, no kids here <laughs> go take a nap Cyril thanks for hanging out and chatting with us though it's always a delight to have you here Harry Potter's Petronio is a stag <laughs> it's a good one <laughs> um but yeah, I think you're right. No! No! I need him to go away. Why won't he go away? <laughs> Stop. I'm about to just take the hits to get away from him. Fucking hell. Whatever. I don't care. I don't want to be around butt burger anymore okay so we flipped the switch <laughs> is that released it it hasn't well I did that bad I guess let's go put the worm in the house and I'm just I'm just spitball in here. I don't know what I'm doing. We're in a bad dungeon and everything sucks. <laughs> worm! We'll equip the worm and then we'll yeet it into... Hold on. I should probably put down a candle or two so I can also see what's happening. Do you want down here, Worm? It's like our well back home, but this has... No. Wall spikes are rude. <laughs> mom, open up, mom! Mom, mom! I see mom inside! Mom, I'm here! Mom? She can't hear me. Smash it. Smash the window. I need this worm to also get the fuck out of my way. Nope, you're okay. Maybe. We could try to give it to. <laughs> I was gonna call him Legolas, because he doesn't have legs. And that's a that's a bad joke. Sticking with it though. Not bad enough to not tell you that I had the thought. <laughs> Too bad his initials aren't don't have an L in it. But, uh, Soldier Boy. 
<laughs> Which also brings up more bad jokes. Yeah, none of the skeletons have a, have fleshy bits. Um, there are no fleshy corpses. There is a gentleman over here, though, who has flesh. I'm stuck. Hey. Those tooth larvae are everywhere. I don't know where they're coming from, but I better avoid them. Okay, no, he just tells me that they're bad. Oops, all bad. Alright, save again. I feel like I'm missing something in the room with all the fire, because we still haven't gotten the emblem there. But I also don't know... Nah, he's just gonna keep bleeding out. He has a lot of blood to spare. We've, uh, we've already discussed this. Not at length, but... It has been discussed. Um, he's just got a lot of blood. Nah, it's cool. It's not actually his blood either. It's uh, He's got like blood bags that he's been storing. And yeah, you missed a lot, my friends. <laughs> I'm sorry. But you're here now. You ready for all the excitement and terribleness? Uh, yeah. Um, that was just from this morning, though. <laughs> that lives there. That's fine to be there. Where? Where? Oh, I haven't been up here, have I? Okay, another box. More bread. Love that for me. I mean, worm might just be for later. We got more candles. Awesome. Perfect. I need to heal. I hurt. <laughs> Everything hurts. I need the pig to stay away from me. fire just done we've solved the fire puzzle give me the real emblem golden emblem I'm keeping this can we gather up the jam I don't have anything to put it in probably not I wish let's carry a little bit with us you know for good luck Never hurts to have extra jam on hand. Uh, no, we got the real emblem, though. So everything is fine. Soak it up with the bread. <laughs> You're expecting this ten-year-old to be thinking with bread. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> Sorry, friend. Let's go save. Hey! Hey, I opened the door! Hey, the door's been opened? I've opened the door. Who are you? Get off, you monster, or I'll cut you to pieces. Easy, easy. It's me, Hans. We talked a while ago. Don't you remember? Hans? Hans. That name. My son is called Hans, too. Excuse me, my friend. I was delirious. I think I've lost a lot of blood. Have you got the right emblem? Yes, I have. I've placed the emblem and a door has opened in the wall. Can we go out now? Did I not say from the get go? From the get go. Mm, get goes. That JF was our daddy. Excuse me. <laughs> He's 100% our dad. Absolutely. Confirmed. We're really close to going, my friend. According to the information I've got on the dungeons, the room you've opened gets to the castle through the ceiling. That's our way out. But how are we going to get there? Take this. I've got a red seed! That looks like a bean to me. It's a magic seed. You'll need to plant it in the room and water it. That way it'll grow to the top. I understand. I plant the seed in the room and I water it. This looks easy. I'll take care of it. Once the plant has grown, come back and come back to me and we'll leave together. I trust you. You shouldn't. 
dude. Let me tell you right here and now, you should not. I'm a terrible child. Magic CD. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a good, good magic bean. Can't copy it, though. It's trademarked. Okay, so... Planting this red seed. It's planted. Now I have to water it to grow. Okay, but I have nothing to put water in? That's a wall. Okay. Um... It's true, it is different from the copywritten magic bean. <laughs> okay, I'm supposed to get water from the well, right? But I have nothing to put it in. They sound like goats. Butt burgers over here do sound like goats. Which is a little distressing at times, but you know. Ma'am! Ma'am! I need this. Fetch some water. Got a bucket of blood! It's full of blood. Well, who knows? It might come in handy to grow the seed. The sound's changed. Nom, food! Food! Whoa, you scared the hell out of me! Why are you out of the backpack? Go back inside! No! You better behave or I'm throwing you into that well over there. That's what it wants. But what am I saying? You'll probably like that. Do it. Get rid of the worm. <laughs> no! Alright, what do you want to eat? I haven't got much. A chestnut? No! Some fruit. An apple, maybe. No! Why me? Bread? No! Well, forget about it. You're not getting the cheese. Sweets! Nom! Sweets? I don't have any. And even if I had, I wouldn't share them with you. Sweets! You're a tiresome worm. Go back in the backpack. Come on, you'll get sweets later. He wants the blood! You thought the kid was smart, but it not. <laughs> it's a stupid child. Worm wants that bucket of blood. It's, yeah, sweetbreads are organs. Accurate. <laughs> I don't remember exactly, like, it's a specific organ, and I want to say it's like a spleen or something, but it might just be like a general, it might just be like generally mean like awful and stuff like that uh but yeah tasty sweet bread <laughs> I personally do not like awful myself it's not not my thing not here for it But hey, to each their own. Okay, bucket of blood. Pour. I'll use the blood. I hope it works. Use the blood bucket. Nothing happened. It might take some time for it to grow. Well, that's just great. <laughs> I was gonna say, we're gonna walk away and it's gonna like shoot up. It was really high. I could use the spikes to climb, but before I leave, I should tell JF. You can just call him daddy. We know it's your dad. Oh, he's dead. He's 100% dead. Sir, sir, wake up. He's dead. Something's shining in his hand. That's odd. This key is really similar to my home's. What was that? Mom? Do we go open the, the home key, or the, yeah, the house now? Well, let's go save. <laughs> Before we make bad decisions. Hello? Well, that 
that's not great. <laughs> what happens if I step on it? We're gonna have two dead parents now. And look, we've already got we've already got our alchemy circle like set up and ready to go. Too bad we don't have a little brother that we can partly sacrifice. Mom? <laughs> Never. I don't need any more buckets with disgusting blood. Or sooner than we anticipate. I'd watch it. <laughs> Did I not get the key? No, I do. I just can't equip it. Okay. Well, I'll use JF's key. Mom? Oh, it's a trap. You know how I know? Because there's cake. This cake looks. Uh, this cake looks delicious. I could uh could have some and regain strength. I'll have some cake. Don't do it! It's gonna kill you! I didn't actually mean to- Oh, no. I thought I was just gonna pick it up. I didn't think he was gonna immediately eat it. What happened to me? I feel really weak. Mom, hold on. You can't- you... I'm gonna move some things real quick. Chat, you gotta be a little smaller. Me, I gotta be a little smaller. No, stop. Okay, maybe not that small. You can kind of see her. You need to see her in full. Look at how bad she is. Also, this noise. Here's mom to take care of you. Mom, what happened to you? You're bleeding. This? Don't you worry. It's not even my blood. <laughs> You're really weak. Why don't you have some more cake? I... No, I'm good. I'm, I'm good, mom. Thanks. Are you alright, mom? You look different. Having you around makes my blood boil. Mom. <laughs> she beat you to it. Realize I won't let you leave ever- or you realize I won't ever let you leave again, don't you? Okay, hey, bye mom. Food. You again. Sweets. I want sweets. Are you alright, mom? You look different. You said you wanted sweets, didn't you? Alright then. There you go. Use the worm with the cake. Sweets! Nom nom nom. Hey, easy. You don't want to choke, do you? Oopsie. What's wrong, Mr. Worm? I need- No! Hold on. Butterfly net. No! Butterfly net! The ugly worm has become a butterfly. Don't you touch it. It's mean. It'll hurt you badly. Let it go, my dear. How about I don't? Mom? So you just came to steal my treasure, didn't you? I won't let you leave with it. Mom! Suddenly bloodborne. This looks really, really bad. I have to catch that butterfly and climb the plant. I can't see. I can't see. Got the butterfly shaped jewel. Butterfly turned into a jewel the moment I caught it. So I better leave this place at once. Okay, but I can't see. No, stop. Queen of the worms. Let me go. Go, 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 go. Climb the thing. Finally leaving. Oh my god. Okay, I have to turn this down because it's way too loud for me. Oh, my legs are shaking. Petronio. Welcome, sire. Oh no, you again. Sire, please accept my sincere apology. I'm terribly sorry for not having explained in detail the last part of the trial. Leave me alone! I don't believe a word you say. I just want to leave this place. I don't want to be rich or a count or anything. I never intended to lie, hide information, or be rude to you, sire. I was only following the count's command. Please accept my apology, sire. 
Without further ado, I would like you to follow me so I can introduce you to my master, the Count. He awaits in the hall. It'll be one of your tricks. I promise the trials are over. Will you please follow me, sire? Maybe. I want to find a safe spot. <laughs> I would like to save. Never mind. There's nowhere to save here. Ugh. Okay, let's keep a candle out just in case. Will you follow me, sire? I guess. <laughs> Carmen. Hans, my grandkid, give me a hug. What? Well, you look at you. You're so big. I haven't seen you since you were a toddler. How old are you? 14? 15? <laughs> right? I know I've been deceitful all game, but like, trust me. I'm 10. Only 10? You look like a grown man. Wait a moment. Are you really my grandpa? I don't know who you are. Oh, yes. Excuse me, Hans. I'm so happy that I forgot to tell you. I mean, I did kind of guess that Lucrezia was my mom. Ten years ago, my daughter Lucrezia, your mom, met your dad, Joseph Frey. They married without my consent and had a son. That's you, Hans. Lucrezia is my mom? Indeed. Lucrezia, my daughter. Your father had to go to war. When he returned, he tried to prove he was worthy of the role by tackling the castle trials. Was he the soldier down there? Yes, that was him. He almost succeeded. Now he has my respect for his great courage and honor. God, I'm oblivious. It was you, Hans, who solved all the riddles, avoided all traps, and bravely came to me. You are the new Count Lucanor. But... <laughs> Son, you are my... You are blood of my blood. Besides, you deserve it most, as you have tackled the trials. What about Mom? And my dog Spittle? So I'm not ever coming back home? Your mother will be here soon, and you, we can always bring your dog if you want. But Hans, do you ri uh, th really think you're going to miss that filthy house of yours? Someone like you deserves to live in a great castle. Sit in the throne, Hans, and become the new Count Lucanor. Mm, I don't trust those two at all. There are more holes in this explanation than in Swiss cheese. So Lucrezia is my mom? The creepy crawly I left down there? No way. I'm not sitting in the throne until I find the truth behind all this. Okay, is there a save point? I can't talk to the servant. Can I talk to Carmen? The humble red Carmen is at, at the tiny mousy mouse's feet. <laughs> I mean, he's smart for now. I don't know anybody, but they seem uh, they seem so happy to see me. Petronio. Congratulations, sire! The trial has ended! You've proved to be worthy of the throne. Now sit and relax. Sorry, okay. Uh Right, the servant has wine. It there was a moment there where I panicked because it looked like his eyes were like bleeding. It was just uh texture tearing as I like moved. I wanna go back. Okay, but what do you want to do then, kid? Like, I can't really talk to a bunch of people. Do you have anything new to say? No. Do you have anything to say? I think I got lost in your explanation. Sit, son, and I'll explain everything to you. You must be exhausted after the trial, sire. Look, I just went through this in, uh... <laughs> In Hollow Knight, where everyone's like, You're so sleepy! Sit down! Take a load off! And then they all attacked me. So... When he sat in the throne, Hans became the new Count Lucanor. Every night he threw parties full of sweets and fun. But Hans never found out. It all made part of the uh it all made part of a curse. Oh. And trapped in his fantasies, he ended up forgetting his mother forever. Shame, really. The 
end. So I bet one of the things that I have to do at the very beginning of the game is talk to the mirror. I'm pretty sure that'll get me, like, the good ending. Do we want to do that? Ah, oh, I'm finally free. He almost unmasked me. <laughs> that was close. Good thing kids are tricked easily. Yeah, well, you wouldn't let me do anything else. What time is it? Two o'clock? I'm streaming for hour, hour 50? Do we want to try again? Try and get the good ending? Because, like, I remember the only thing that we really, like, didn't do was get information from the mirror because we didn't do it soon enough, right? But since I kind of have a better idea of, like, where to go, I could probably get enough coins together to buy the gold key and go upstairs sooner. Yeah, let's do it. Hey, don't freeze on me, game. Okay. Can I skip all this? <laughs> there might have been... I mean, I can always go back and see what we can do with the butterfly. Hold on. Can I just skip through this? Kind of. Again, I don't necessarily know that we had enough information to, to be able to use any of the things. Um, yeah, Hans. No, Hans, honey. All done. <laughs> I need you to stop talking. Or I wonder if I have to, like, not give any of this... Give any of the stuff to people. Continue. Yeah, let's try this again. So we got the key, right? Also, where is the sound? Sound, where have you gone? <laughs> sound is just gone forever. sound sound is gone we do, there are no there are no sounds for this game anymore a done did breaked it we'll use jf's key hold on a second can we mom Let's just do this. <laughs> no. Oh god, that was so loud. It might moan at me. I don't know that they would. Like, cause there should have been there should have been music. And there wasn't. And also the skin burgers were gone. They should have been where the, the circle was, but because of where we are, they're gone. They're sound now though, so we're good. <laughs> she break easy this game I've noticed but it's okay there we go we got sound now it's back just had to reset it <laughs> um okay yeah we got the key so we just gotta go talk to mom I guess I'm also gonna put some candles down now so that when it comes time to run away from spooky scary mom from Lucrezia, then we'll just be like good to go. You know? <laughs> Actually, I could be a cool kid and help participate in the in the ritual. That's how you do. <laughs> there we go um ouch worms but yeah we can try to like 
use some of the items and stuff, but I don't know that, like, I can actually do anything. Mom, wake up. Mom! Son! Mom, what's wrong? What are you doing here? Hush, my dear, I'm fine. When you left, I was so sad that I got sick. But now you've come back, I'll be alright really soon. But how did you get to the castle? And why is our house here? Castle? What do you mean, son? Count Lucanor's castle. Have you met a count in your journey? Why me? You've become an important person, my child. No, I haven't. Mom. Hey, look what I've made for you. It's a birthday cake. Thanks, Mom. You were so upset when you left that I decided to sell some things and bought honey, flour, and eggs so you could have a nice surprise when you returned. That wasn't necessary, Mom. I was such a fool for leaving. I was upset, but not anymore. But we can't stay here. We've got to come- or you've got to come with me. I feel weak, my dear. Let's wait for a while. Why don't you taste the cake? How about I don't? <laughs> Mom, how about I don't? Said you wanted sweets, didn't you? Alright then, there you go. Yeah, let's skip some of this. Sweets! Nom nom nom! Hey, easy, you don't want to choke, do you? Whoopsie, what's wrong, Mr. Worm? Mom just stayed in bed this entire time. Whoa, the ugly worm has become a butterfly. Don't you touch it. It's mean. It'll hurt you badly. Let it go, my dear. Mom, we need to leave this place. But honey, where do you want to go? Do you want to leave me alone again? No, I don't, Mom. I don't mean that. Cake looks delicious. I could have some and regain strength. Don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. Okay, yeah, she's not gonna... She's just gonna be bad the entire time. Hans, are you leaving? Guess you're old and you don't need your mom anymore. We're just gonna go. Mom? Now she's all bloody. Yeah, no, Mom, I wasn't here for you. Sorry, bud. I know. You're big and scary, but I like your 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 design. It's very cool. No! Okay. Better leave this place. I don't like that she's just, like, spilling blood out from under her dress. <laughs> very nudable arms. I had forgotten about that. Oh, Travis, what have you done? <laughs> oh, no. I had forgotten about noodable boys. Oh, dang. Your legs are shaking. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Trust me, it's fine. Trust me, I've done nothing wrong ever. Trust me. Can I hold up this mirror to him? Here, take this mirror. <sighs> Don't know anybody. I don't like all this chattering I don't remember that father had to go to war like the the sound so that was him he almost succeeded now he has my respect for his great courage and honor god I'm oblivious but and that's all the same trust us to at all. There are more holes in this explanation. So crazy is my mom, a creepy crawly. I'm not sitting on the throne until I find out the truth behind all this. I think I got lost in your explanation. Ha ha! We just had to use the ring. Count Lucanor is a fraud. What are you saying, Hans? The snake ring tells me you're a fraud. You're not the true Count Lucanor. Oh, please. Darned old woman and darned old magic ring. Just as you were about to sit. Wait a moment. You've got to explain all this. 
Where do I start? Hundreds of years ago, the true Count Luthanor commanded me to find an heir, as he had no offspring. So I prepared the trials and challenges in the castle. Young men from all kingdoms heeded the Count's call, for they coveted his vast fortune. But none of them managed to tackle the trials. So why didn't you prepare an easier test? That's what I suggested to the Count. But he was really stubborn. He wanted the best for the best. Or best of the best. Years went by and no one succeeded. The Count aged and got sick. As he was facing death and had no heir, he feared I might choose some useless human being for the role. Thus, before he died, he called a witch in the woods and commanded her to curse both me and the castle. Did he force you to stay here for life? No, he didn't. Instead, he bound me forever. I would only be free when someone tackled all trials. And I've tackled them. You have! I've welcomed countless knights, thieves, fortune seeker soldiers, or mere curious people every night for the past centuries. And the only one who managed to tackle all trials was a ten-year-old poor kid. Unbelievable. So the people I've met tonight, all the things about my family, my father, my mother, the curse is playing tricks with your memories. It's all lies. I've got a final question. What would happen if I sat on the throne? My curse would be over and I would have completed my task. But you'd be trapped in the castle forever. Forever? Well, that's just great. But you'd be rich, of course, and you could use the money as you pleased. I thought you were sick of being poor. Yes, that's true, but what about my mom? If you decided to be the new count and sat, uh, set me free, I'd owe you. And, well, we could make some sort of deal. You uh, already know everything I know. Now it's your call. If you want to put an end to my curse, you should sit in the throne. On the contrary, if you want to leave, there's an exit behind it. Just push the throne and you'll be outside. Can I use the butterfly net on him? No. I mean, we've seen what happens when we sit on the throne, right? And I don't believe that he would do anything to help us. So I think, I would imagine it would probably end in the same ending. It's been nice meeting you, Hans. You too, Petronio. Goodbye. This is a trap! I mean, this is also a trap. It's all traps. Oops, all traps. Cario. How's it going? Welcome. Safe soul. Ouch, my head. I'm back. I made it out of the castle. Was everything a dream? It's going good. We're just finishing up Count Lucanor. Got Raven again. What does he want? This is my mom. Hey, Mr. Raven. I've got a headache. What do you want? You want me to see the tombstone? The tombstone belongs to my mother. She's dead. We got the bad ending. This might be an okay ending. <laughs> alright, alright. Let's see the inscription. Joseph Frey. Joseph Frey is the name of my dad. So my dad's dead? Mom always told me dad was fighting the war and he'd come back someday. It's my father's tomb. Whose is this then? This is a really old tomb. It's so worn I can't read the name. Is there anything up here? There is... A box. Got a candle. There's a note. I discovered the legend of Count Lucanor on my way back home. I just couldn't get there empty handed. Signed by JF. Aww. Yeah, we'll see if this is a good ending. I mean, it's already a bit better. Ebenezer Scrooge. Also, the dogs. This? Okay, hold on a second. This here. Looks a lot like the park in Yuppie Psycho. I wonder if they... I wonder if they're the dead. 100%! That, that section of the game was a callback to this. And I like that. I'm sorry I didn't know about it beforehand. Goats! Also, the goat herd. He is not headless anymore. Hello? He's sleeping, sleeping soundly. Better leave him be. Goats! Knights! What does this say? All those above 15 shall report to their uh, nearest gendarmerie at once. Now that I know what I'm saying. Hey kiddo, we're, look uh, we're looking for young men to go to war. Do you know any? 
There are only old men and kids around here. You better go to the village. Hey, and you don't know who's taking care of these goats, do you? The goats take care of themselves, sir. Ah, oh, we're a good kid. Didn't rat out on our friend. Who happened to get us drunk, but, you know, it's fine. Ah! Oh! Seems they sent someone to pick up yesterday's mess. Hi, horsey. It's a nice horse, but where's that donkey gone? I don't know, but we gotta give him an apple. Do I have apples still? I do. Perfect. Of course the donkey's not gonna be a donkey corn anymore. <gasps> Spittle! Have you come to look for me? Thank you, Spittle. I'm so happy to see you. Hey, have you taken care of mom as I told you? Mom's 100% dead. Like, let's... Atta boy. Alright then, let's go see her. She'll be worried. Cursed Gorge. Dog, 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 Merchant's not fine. It's a sign. It reads thief. Well. That's unfortunate. He was kind of a dick, though. Dog, you're, you're stuck. Dog, you're stuck. Dog. Dog. Oh no. Dog. Dog. Okay. We fixed the dog. Dog's not broken anymore. Okay. Where's the donkey, though? I don't give a shit about the immersion. I only care about the donkey. Donkey's not here. Sad. Goats? Screaming goats? There's that deer again. Get out of here, deer. There's the old lady. Hey, ma'am. Hello, son. You haven't seen my pig, have you? I was on my way to the market, but he left running all the way up. He really likes the woods. Can't tell why. Yeah, I think Merchant and Donkey were definitely cart thieves. Sorry, I haven't seen him. Oh, how tiring can this pig be? It's worse than a son. I don't think I can do anything for her. Oof. that hangman's woods i don't think we went this direction the last time like when we first started out i think i just like immediately went north i don't want to go to the village now i want to go back home and see mom all right never mind get out of here rabbits i fucking hate you get be gone shoo All right, well, we got the credits going. I think this might be the... I don't want to say it's the good ending. I just have this bad feeling that mom is dead. At least this is uh, this is clear and fresh water. Just going to check everything. It's empty. Donkey! <gasps> now I have a dog and a donkey. Perfect. Donkey, I have more apples for you if you would like them. Mr. Donkey, have you come to stay with us? Have an apple, Mr. Donkey. Fuse them. I mean, it would save on food. Oh, seems you won't poop any more gold. <laughs> have an apple, Mr. Donkey. Yeah. 
Mom will be really happy with the donkey. Okay, Mom's alive. We're good. Mom? Hans! Come to me, kid. They've made up. Mom, forgive me. You were right. I'm still too young to leave home. Don't you worry, my dear. I'll never disobey and I'll keep- uh, I'll help you with the housekeeping and I won't ask you about Dad ever again. Son, about your father, there's something you need to know. I already know, Mom. I've seen his grave in the woods. Joseph died at war when you were a baby. I didn't want to tell you. Forgive me, son. I'm fine, Mom. Don't worry about me. I'm already ten, don't you remember? Would you like to see what I brought you for my adventure? Sure, show me. Alright then. I've got five pieces of bread here. We can use them to have toast for breakfast for some days in a row. They're delicious. Look, Mom, I brought you a mirror. God, I'm having such a bad hair day. We'll hang it on the wall so we can look nice when we go to the village. I've also collected this crowbar. It, uh, I got it from a goat herd. It's really useful. Right on. It'll come in handy if we need to do some home repairs. Yeah, I don't have any apples, but I gave them to the donkey. I did bring a donkey. So I think that makes up for the lack of apples. Look, I brought 12 candles. They were everywhere. Blimey, I don't know what to do with so many candles. We could sell them in the village, or even open a store. I've also collected this net. It's a butterfly net. I think you'll have more fun with this than me. Look, Mom, a magic ring. I got it from a lady in exchange for the cane. Well, maybe it doesn't work anymore. What's this? It looks priceless, Hans. We could get some good money if we sell it in the village market. I've also got nine coins. That's a lot of money, son. I'm really proud of you. I hope, though, you haven't stolen this, have you? And look, this jewel is hidden in a nasty dungeon. Whoa, but this is priceless, son. Hey, I hope you haven't stolen this, have you? But truth is, if we sell the jewel, all our money troubles would be over. This is it. I don't have anything else. Why, that's a lot of things. I believe we could use this to buy some sweets in the village. What do you say? Yay! We did it! did it from that day on Hans helped his mother with the housekeeping and although they ne weren't never were rich they lived happily ever after good end yeah 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 the end good game I appreciate the fact that it was easier to get at least two of the endings without having to replay the entire game. It's short enough that it would be fine to have to. Um, but that's probably my only complaint about Yuppie Psycho is that, like, I was looking looking it up to see, like, how to get some of the other endings. And some of them, like, you have to make specific choices super early on in the game. And it is definitely a longer one, um, which makes doing multiple ending runs a, a little more difficult and a bit more time consuming um right <laughs> and the castle continued to test passers-by forever killing the strangers what a lovely story <laughs> that was a lot of fun though i really really enjoyed that um good game if people are interested in it it is i want to say last i knew it was on sale on steam for like two bucks um and i think it was also on sale on the switch which is what i was playing it on i don't know if the sales are still going on but it's a pretty cheap game all things considered um and also just a good it's good good game i liked the puzzles they were very uh for the most part straightforward my only issue was the library one but that's just because i didn't think about waiting longer <laughs> um all right yeah it looks like it is ten dollars on steam at the moment um but that's for the game and the soundtrack or you could spend 22 dollars to get the count luke north and yuppie psycho so you know that's not too bad, because I think Yuppie Psycho is like a $15 game on its own. $17 game. 
yeah, so well worth worth the price to get both of them. You might as well. Yuffie Psycho is a super fantastic game done in the same style. Um, also has really good puzzles in it. I really enjoyed that game. Um, and I might play it again in the uh, for our afternoon streams at some point to try and do some of the other endings. If people are interested in that, I can always do that on my own time as well, though. Um, but yeah, that was the Count Lucanor. I liked it. I liked it. And it's true, we don't wait. We're gamers. We gotta go. We gotta go now. Immediately do the thing. Um, let's set up a raid. Looks like I've got two people on at the moment. Hugh Chu is playing some Tales of Berseria. I know they weren't feeling super great. Um, and are planning on playing for a very, very long time. So that's an option. Otherwise, William is Young is playing New World. Uh, as in like... No, I'm thinking of a different game. All right. I am unfamiliar with this game, but that is also an option. Um, also willing to take suggestions for other people that we can raid. Uh, so it's up to y'all. What do we want to do? <laughs> Recommendation, recommendation, suggestions? Uh, I know William's a buddy. William's pretty cool. We like William. Uh, they also just recently hit affiliate just like a, a week or two ago, which is always fun. Um, it looks like they have less viewers than Chu does. Let's go hang out with William. Let's go say hi to William. Uh, as always, there are our raid messages. The first one is one if you are not a, um, do -do 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 -do, not a sub. Second one is if you are. Oh, is the day that he beat the Capra Demon? That's a good day. <laughs> that sounds like a good day to me. Um, but yeah, let's go hang out with William, check out this game that none of us know what it is, uh, and I'll be back this evening with some Fatal Frame. I'm very excited about it. I'm also preemptively wearing my Japanese folklore t-shirt. It's the Kuchisaka Ona, the slit-mouthed woman. Um, anywho, I'll see y'all later. Have a great rest of your day.